Good day, good morning, everyone, or good day, everyone. My name is Dion, and I'm from the Nahalk Nation and the Seashell Nation, and I'll be your instructor today. So let's do some cleansing breaths to awaken our spirit. Breathe in for three, hold for three, exhale for three. Inhale. Hold, exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Let's do a clockwise circle while we do our inhales. Inhale. Exhale. Rotate in a counterclockwise, inhale, exhale, let's roll our shoulders back, up to our ears, down back, waking up those shoulders, rotate forward, Okay, so I'm going to get everyone to come into child's pose. Up onto all fours, push down into chaturanga, back into child's pose. On all fours, chaturanga, push back to child's pose. On all four, chaturanga, push back to child's pose. Let's come to tabletop. We're going to do a cat cow. Inhale, cat. Exhale, cow. And find your flow. Tuck your toes under and lift your knees off the mat and we're going to slowly start to wake up our, the backs of our legs, walking our dog. Slowly walk to center, roll up to Tadasana. So from here, I'm going to get you to sink down into chair, arms overhead, hold, no pulse. And release. Inhale, arms overhead. Sink down into chair, and we're going to pulse it out. Release. Roll your shoulders, inhale, arms overhead. We're gonna take a bend, half them to the right, opening up the left side body. Inhale, come back to center. Exhale, let's drop to the left. Inhale, back to center, release the arms, roll the shoulders. I'm going to get you to come to the top of your mat. We're going to start with some morning salutations. Inhale, arms overhead. Exhale, fold forward. And here, let's just spend a moment here. You can keep your legs bent. We're just going to hang out here and release that lower back. If it's in your practice, you can grab both um, elbows. Swing left to right. Release the hands to the mat. Inhale, lengthen and look up. Exhale, fold forward. Right leg back into runner's lunge. Left leg back into high plank. You can drop to your knees. Chaturanga. 
high plank. Chaturanga, upward facing dog. Tuck your toes under and push back to your first down dog. So we'll spend a moment here, walking our dog, sinking down in, lifting your hips up to father's sky. Release into your practice. Moving into a three-legged down dog, right leg up. Sweep your right leg through your hands. Bring your left foot forward. Roll up to Tadasana. We're going to repeat on the left side. Inhale, arms overhead. Interlock your fingers. Release your index. Take a half moon back bend. Inhale back to center. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, fold forward. Left leg back into runner's lunge. Right leg back into high plank. Chaturanga, high plank. Chaturanga, up dog. Tuck your toes under. Push down to down dog. Three-legged down dog. Left leg up. Sweep your leg through your hands. Right leg comes forward. Roll up to Tadasana. Moving into twisted sun salutations with a few fun add-ons. Inhale, arms overhead. Interlock your fingers. Release your index. Exhale, take a half moon back then. Inhale back to center, exhale fold forward, inhale lengthen and look up, exhale fold forward, right leg back into runner's lunge, left leg back into high plank, chaturanga high plank, chaturanga up dog, tuck your toes under, and push back to down dog. We're going to add on here, three-legged down dog, left leg up. Bring your knee to your chest, kick it back up. Knee to chest, kick it back up. Last one, knee to chest, and bring it all the way through. So here, we're adding a twist. So our left hand stays on Mother Earth, and our right hand floats up. Right hand to the mat, left leg forward, roll up to Tadasana. Repeat on the left side. Inhale, arms overhead, interlock your fingers, release your index, exhale, take a half moon back bend. Inhale back to center, exhale, fold forward, lengthen and look up. Exhale, fold forward. Left leg back into runner's lunge. Right leg back into high plank. Chaturanga, high plank. Chaturanga, up dog. Fold your toes under, down to down dog. Three-legged down dog, left leg up. Knee to chest, kick it back up. Knee to chest, kick it back up. Knee to chest, and bring your leg all the way through to runner's lunge. Right hand stays on Mother Earth, and her left hand floats up to Father Sky. Left hand down, right leg forward, roll up to Tadasana. So that completes our morning salutation, or sorry, sun salutation. We're going to take a quick water break and move into um, our second vinyasa. <clears throat> so come to the top of your mat. 
Inhale, arms overhead. Interlock your fingers, release your index. Exhale, take a half moon back bend. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, lengthen and look up. Exhale, fold forward. So from here, you can walk or jump back to high plank. Chaturanga, high plank. Chaturanga, up dog. Fold your toes under, push down to down dog. Three-legged down dog, right leg up, knee to chest, kick it back up, knee to chest, kick it back up, knee to chest, kick it back up, and bring your right leg all the way through to runner's lunge. Hands on your hips, tilt your upper body up, arms above your head, square your hips, crescent moon half lunge. And we're gonna pulse here. Drop your left knee to Mother Earth. Interlock your fingers, point your index, salute the gods and the goddesses. Back to center, inhale, lengthen. Exhale, take a half moon back bend. Inhale, back to center, both hands to the mat. Come up to runner's lunge, left leg forward, roll up to Tadasana. We're gonna repeat on the left side. Inhale, arms overhead. Interlock your fingers, release your index. Take a half moon back bend. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, fold forward. Lengthen and look up. Exhale, fold forward. Left leg back into runner's lunge. Right leg back into high plank. Chaturanga, high plank. Chaturanga, up dog. Fold your toes under and push back to the down dog. Left leg up. Bring your knee to your chest. Kick it back up. Knee to chest. Kick it back up knee to chest and bring your left leg through to runner's lunge. Hands to your hips, hinge your upper body up, arms overhead and we're going to pulse it out here. Drop your right knee to Mother Earth. Interlock your fingers. We're gonna salute the gods and the goddesses. Inhale, come back to center. Ex inhale, lengthen. Exhale, take a half moon back bend. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, both hands to the mat. Come up to runner's lunge. Right leg forward. Roll up to Tadasana. Hi, everyone. Welcome. Does it does everyone mind to turn on their perfect? Hi. Good morning. I think I may have started a little bit early. I just began when nobody was here. So if I can get everyone to, I guess we'll start from the beginning, sitting on our mat. Oh. Good day, everyone. My name is Chimik, and I come from the Nuhalk Nation, which is in Bella Coola, British Columbia, Canada, on my mother's side, and the Seashell Nation, which is on the Sunshine Coast near Vancouver, British Columbia, Canada. 
I'll be your instructor today. Thank you for joining me. So we're gonna take some deep breaths in, hold, and exhale, hold. And while we're doing this, we're gonna, we'll do one or two on its own, and then we're gonna do a clockwise, counterclockwise swirl with our ribs. So let's take a deep breath in. Hold. And exhale out the mouth. Hold. Inhale through the nose. Exhale. We're going to take a tiny clockwise swirl. Inhale. Hold. Exhale. Now swirl in the opposite direction. Inhale. Hold. Exhale. Swirling in the opposite direction. Inhale. Hold. Exhale. Swirl in the opposite direction last time. Inhale. Exhale. I'm going to ask you to move into a child's pose. And we're going to flow through to a chaturanga a couple times. Inhale, come to tabletop, chaturanga, tabletop, child's pose. Tabletop, chaturanga, tabletop, child's pose. Tabletop, chaturanga, tabletop, child's pose. Hold here for a moment. Hmm. Setting some intentions for your practice today. I'm going to come to tabletop and we'll do a couple cat cow. Inhale into cow. Exhale into cow. And find your flow. Coming into tabletop, tuck your toes under. Hover up to your knees, kind of pushing back to um, down dog, but we're going to jump forward and roll up to Tadasana. Inhale, arms overhead. Sink down into chair. And hold. Exhale. Inhale, arms overhead, sink down into chair, and we're going to pulse it out here. Exhale. Inhale, arms overhead, interlock your fingers. Inhale, lengthen, and we're going to drop down to our right, opening up our left side body. Inhale back to center, exhale, fold to the left, opening up that right side body. Inhale back to center. Rotate the shoulders back a few times, lift them up to your ears, back, down, front, and then opposite direction. I'm going to invite you to the top of your mat and we're going to move into a sun salutation flow. Inhale, arms overhead. Exhale, fold forward. And right here, we're going to hang out a little bit, keeping our knees bent and we're opening up that lower back. 
variation. You can grab your elbows and swing left to right gently. Back to center, inhale, lengthen and look up. Exhale, fold forward. Right leg back into runner's lunge. Left leg back into high plank. For modified, you can drop to your knees. Chaturanga, high plank. Chaturanga, down dog. Tuck your toes under and push back to your first down dog. And here we're gonna walk out our dog a bit. Sinking down in a little deeper. Moving into a three-legged down dog, right leg up. Sweep your right leg through to runner's lunge. Left leg forward. Roll up to Tadasana. We're gonna repeat on the left side. Inhale, arms overhead. Interlock your fingers, release your index. Exhale, take a half moon back bend. Squeeze your glutes. Inhale back to center. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, lengthen and look up. Exhale, fold forward. Left leg back into runner's lunge. Right leg back into high plank. Chaturanga, high plank. Chaturanga, up dog. Tuck your toes under, push back to down dog. Three-legged down dog. Left leg up. Sweep your leg through <clears throat> to runner's lunge. Right leg forward. Roll up to Tadasana. Excellent. We're gonna move into a twisted morning salutation with some variations. Inhale, arms overhead. Interlock your fingers, release your index. Sit up straight, engage your glutes. Exhale, take a half moon back bend. Inhale back to center. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, lengthen and look up. Exhale, fold forward. From here, you can jump or hop back to high plank. Chaturanga, high plank. Chaturanga, up dog. Fold your toes under. Push back to down dog. <clears throat> so here's a variation on a three-legged down dog. Right leg up. Bring your knee to your chest. Kick it back up. Three-legged down dog. Knee to chest. Kick it back up. Knee to chest. Kick it back up. Right leg comes through to runner's lunge. And our left hand stays on Mother Earth, and our right arm and hand float up to Father Sky. Both hands down to the mat, left leg forward. Roll up to Tadasana. Repeating on the left side. Inhale, arms overhead. Interlock your fingers, release your index. Exhale, take a half moon back bend. Inhale back to center. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, lengthen and look up. Exhale, fold forward. Walk or jump back to high plank. Chaturanga, high plank. Chaturanga, up dog. Fold your toes under and push back to down dog. Variation on the three-legged down dog. <clears throat> Left leg up. 
Bring your knee to your chest. Kick it back up. Knee to chest. Kick it back up. Knee to chest. Kick it back up. And bring it through to runner's lunge. So our right hand stays on Mother Earth and our left hand floats up to Father Sky. Hand down to mat, bring your right leg forward, slowly roll up to Tadasana. And that completes our first vinyasa. We can take a quick water break. You should feel the sweating. We're working to activate the fire within our body. Earth, air, wind, fire. <clears throat> Come back to the top of your mat. We're going to move into our second vinyasa, salute to the gods and the goddesses. Inhale, arms overhead, interlock your fingers, release your index, exhale, take a half moon back bend. Inhale back to center, exhale, fold forward. Lengthen and look up. Exhale, fold forward, jump or walk back to high plank. Chaturanga, high plank. Chaturanga, up dog. Fold your toes under and push back to down dog. Right leg up. Sweep your right leg through your hands into runner's lunge. Put both hands on your hips. Hinge your upper body up. Square your hips. Both hands overhead. Crescent lunge. Let's pulse it out here. Drop your left knee to Mother Earth. Really, um, interlock your fingers, release your index, salute the gods and the goddesses. Inhale back to center. Exhale, we're gonna push our weight onto our back foot. Exhale, take a half moon back bend. Inhale back to center, both hands to the mat. Raise up to runner's lunge, left leg forward. Roll up to Tadasana. Repeating on the left side. Inhale, arms overhead. Interlock your fingers, release your index. Exhale, take a half moon back bend. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, lengthen and look up. Exhale, fold forward. Jump or walk back to high plank or modified high plank. Chaturanga, high plank. Chaturanga, up dog. Fold your toes under and push back to down dog. Left leg up. Sweep your left leg through, <clears throat> both hands on your hips, hinge your upper body up, sink down, square your hips, both hands overhead, crescent lunge. We're gonna pulse it out here. Drop your right knee to Mother Earth, interlock your fingers, release your index, Salute the gods and the goddesses. Your fingertips touch Mother Earth. Back to center. Exhale. We're going to push our weight into our back leg. Exhale. Take a half moon back bend. Inhale back to center. Both hands to the mat. Raise up to the lunge. Right leg comes forward. 
Roll up to Tadasana. Moving into our twisted salute to the gods and the goddesses. Inhale, arms overhead. Interlock your fingers, release your index. Exhale, take a half moon back bend. Inhale back to center, exhale, fold forward. Inhale, lengthen and look up. Exhale, fold forward. Both hands to the mat. Walk or jump back <coughs> to high plank or modified high plank. Chaturanga, high plank. Chaturanga, up dog. Fold your toes under, push back to down dog. Three-legged down dog, right leg up. Sweep your right leg through to runner's lunge. Both hands on your hips, hinge your upper body up. Both hands overhead. We're gonna pulse it out here. Hold, hands in prayer down to heart. We're gonna move into a twisted crescent lunge. Our left elbow goes to our right knee and we gaze up over our right shoulder, looking up at Father Sky. Back to center, drop your left knee down to Mother Earth, hands above your head, interlock your fingers, release your index, Salute the gods and the goddesses. Our fingertips just touch Mother Earth and come back to center. Exhale, take a half moon back bend. Inhale back to center, both hands to the mat. Raise up to runner's lunge, left leg forward. Roll up to Tadasana. We're gonna repeat the twisted Salute to the gods and the goddesses on the left side. Inhale, arms overhead. Interlock your fingers, release your index. Exhale, take a half moon back bend. Inhale back to center. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, lengthen and look up. Exhale, fold forward, both hands to the mat. Walk or jump back to high plank or modified high plank. Chaturanga, high plank. Chaturanga, up dog. Fold your toes under and push back to down dog. Three-legged down dog on the left side, left leg up. Sweep your left leg through to runner's lunge, both hands on your hips, hinge your upper body up, arms above your head, crescent lunge. Let's pulse it out here. Hold, drop your right knee to Mother Earth, interlock your fingers, release your index, salute the gods and the goddesses. Fold forward, Fingertips touch Mother Earth, back up, exhale, take a half moon back bend. Inhale, back to center, both hands to the mat. Back up to runner's lunge, hands to your hips, coming back up to crescent lunge, I forgot the twist. Hands to heart center, our right elbow goes to our left knee, twisting up. Inhale back to center, both hands to the mat, runner's lunge, right leg forward, roll up to Tadasana. Oh, so that completes our flows. And we're gonna move into some balancing poses, and then we'll get some ab work done. Come 
to the center of your mat. We're gonna balance our weight evenly on both feet. Shift slightly to the left and you can open your knee into first position tree. We're gonna lift our right leg up all the way into your crotch area if that is in your practice or you can grab the top part of your hand and lay your foot upside down. And you wanna push your right knee back, sitting up straight, find a focal point that'll help your balance. And I find sometimes if I put my finger in my belly button, that helps balance too. Right hand to heart center. When you're ready, left hand to heart center. Tree pose. In the Northwest of Canada, we have huge cedar trees. They're a tree of life. We make our canoes, our longhouses, our clothing, our weapons out of them. So in this pose, I always say thank you to this tree of life, the cedar tree. And release, give it a shake, shake, shake. <sighs> Balancing both weight evenly, shift to your right, go into first position. And you can lift all the way up to your crotch if this is what you prefer, or grab the uh, top of your foot, facing your foot upside down, pushing your left knee out, squaring your hips, left hand to heart center, right hand to heart center. We say thank you to all the trees. In ceremony here, we call them the the tall ones. And in my language, we say all notes. That means thank you. Release, shake out that tree. Ooh, we're gonna move to the back of your mat and we're gonna go into balancing staff or balancing twig. Inhale, arms overhead. Interlock your fingers, release your index, lift your rib cage, engage your core. We are going to take our left foot forward and slowly put all our weight onto that left foot. Find your drishti, your focal point, and hold. Lifting that top leg, you want to be like a capital T. Come back to center, back to the back of your mat, and shake it out. Inhale, arms overhead, interlock your fingers, release your index. We're going to take a step forward with our right foot. Slowly putting all our weight onto that right foot, lifting our left leg. Square your hips, should be parallel to Mother Earth. Inhale back to center, come back to the back of your mat and shake it out. Um, come to um, the middle of your mat. We're going to move into bow pose. So my right hand is going to go out to the side and my palm will be facing up and I'm going to grab the back of my right foot. And the reason why you want your palms up is because it'll open up that shoulder. So you'll get a nice shoulder opening. Squeeze your knees together, left hand goes up, palm facing forward. We're gonna kick back into that right foot and slowly lean forward into bow pose. If you fall out, come back in. And release and come back to center. We're going to switch to our left side. Palm goes out, uh, palm facing up. Grab the back, our left hand grabs our left foot. Squeeze your knees together, engage your core, right hand above your head, palm facing forward. Kick back into that left leg and bend forward into bow. Come back to center and release. Shake, shake, shake. 
And it's pretty normal to have one side more dominant than the other. My left side seems to be a bit more dominant in that area. So I come from the Eagle Clan, and this is one of my favorite poses. So we're gonna go into Eagle Pose, inhale arms to the side. Now my right hand is gonna come under my left hand and my hands are gonna clasp each other, okay? So now that they're twisted, I'm gonna sit down into chair, pulling my shoulders down, sucking my belly button to my spine, lift my right leg over my left and sit down into Eagle Pose. Ideally, you'd want to be able to um, get your ankle around the other ankle, but I don't, I'm not quite there yet. Sink a little further, hold a little tighter, sit up straight, oh, and release. Oh, eagle pose on the left side. Inhale, arms out. Now my left hand is gonna go under my right. My hands are gonna clasp. I'm gonna sit down into chair. Sit up straight. I'm going to pull my shoulders down, suck my belly in, lift my leg, left leg over my right, and sit down into eagle pose. Sit up straight. Sit a little deeper. Sit up straight. And release. Come back to center. Ooh, shake, shake, shake. All right. We are going to move down to the mat to get some core work done. I think we'll do a little bit of stretching first. So let's take our right leg up to our chest and pull in tight. I'm taking a herbology diploma and I was just studying the colon and I remember Kate telling us how this pose is really good for your ascending colon. And release your left leg, sorry, right leg. Let's pull in our left leg. And now this pose is good for your descending colon. So you want both feet flexed, pulling your knee to your chest. Release your left knee down and pull both knees together. So if you have your hands on your knees, that's fine, but you kind of want to get to where you have your hands on your elbows, pulling in tight. And release. We're going to go from here into our happy baby. So some people grab the outside of their feet, some people grab the inside of their feet, some people grab their toes, however you like your baby. Some people rock their babies. Okay, release your happy baby, both legs down to the mat. We're gonna do 20 Pilates style sit-ups. Hands above your head. So you want to sit up and touch your toes and go back down. And your feet stay on the floor. Last one. Oh. Grab your toes. Let's feel a little stretch in the back of the legs and the lower back. And release. We're going to move down into um, onto our belly and get ready for some plank. So your elbows can be straight forward or they can be interlocked. 
We're going to do two sessions of 30 seconds. Okay. Engage your core and lift up. And release. Left ear to the mat, both hands to your side. And back to center. We're going to move on to our left elbow and we're going to do a side plank. So engage your core, left hand down. Your hand can be on your hip, on the side, and lift up. And release down with your right ear to the mat. Mm. Inhale back to center, onto our right elbow. We're gonna do a side plank on our right elbow. And inhale, lift up. And release down with our left ear to the mat. Hmm. Inhale back to center. Your hands are just by your shoulders. Put your toes together and zip your legs together. We're going to go into cobra pose. So inhale, you want to lift your rib cage off the mat. Exhale, come down, left ear to the mat. Mm. Inhale back to center, hands under your shoulders, back into cobra, toes together, zip your legs up, and lift your rib cage off the mat. Pulling your shoulder blades down your back. Your hands shouldn't be pushing. Your hands should be able to be moved away and your back still up. Exhale, down, right ear to the mat. Inhale back to center. Let's push up to tabletop. Go into your cat cow. Inhale, cat. Exhale, cow. Inhale, cow. Exhale, cow. One more time. Inhale, cat. Exhale, cow. Bring yourself to a seated position. We're going to go into what's called the half lord of the fish. So my left leg is going to, left foot is going to come under my right buttocks and I'm going to cross my left foot over my knee. So the bottom part of my body is twisting to the left. My left hand goes above, crossing over my right knee, twisting back. So we're going to inhale, stretch up, exhale, twist a little deeper. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, twist. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, twist. And release, you can come into a counter twist before you untwist your legs. We're gonna untwist our legs. Now my right foot is gonna come under my left buttock, my left foot over my right knee 
twisting my lower body. My right hand goes in the air, crosses over my left knee, and I'm turning and looking over my left. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, twist. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, twist. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, twist. Release your upper body up. Come into a counter twist. And release your lower legs. We are going to lay down on our back and go into a figure four or foot to knee. So my left foot is going to come over my right knee. And I'm going to thread my hands through to grab, grab underneath my right knee, both feet flexed. For a deeper stretch, you can use your left elbow and push that left knee out while you're pulling in close. Release your right foot down to the mat. We're going to keep our ankle on our knee and drop it open and twisting our upper body to the right. Release your left foot off your knee and bring both knees to the center. And now we're going to take our right foot and cross it over our left knee. And then I'm going to thread my hands through, grabbing the back of my left knee, and both feet are flexed. You should feel this in your right glute. Release your left foot down to the floor. We're going to keep our right foot on our knee and drop to the right. And then our upper body is going to look to the left. Stretching out that top of that left hip. Release your right foot off the knee and bring both knees to the center. We're going to move into Savasana or corpse pose. So in this pose, you just lie down ankles together, your hands by your side. I like to shimmy my shoulder blades down my back and let your feet flop open. Let your eyes sink to the back of the, your head. And you can feel Mother Earth just pulling away any negativity. Just give it to Mother Earth. Wiggling our toes and our fingers, rotating our wrists and our ankles, fluttering our eyes open. Slowly move into a fetal position. And here we always give thanks to our mothers. We're thankful for this life, another day on this planet. With the top hand, slowly push yourself back up to cross-legged seated position. Mm. Hands to heart center. Mm. In my language, we say oh no, and that means thank you. All my relations, namaste.